Hello, and I'm going to fix the problem where you want to open up the Valorant point store, but it just keeps infinite loading. So in my case, I already fixed it, but if you have this problem, then I have a method for you. So first of all, just go ahead and sign out. Just click exit to desktop, click on sign out and exit, and then sign out of your Valorant account. You will need to log in back again, open up Valorant, check if it works. Maybe it will, if it does, it's really good then you don't need to do any of this other stuff. Well, if that didn't work, then we're gonna go ahead and try the second thing, which is to, if you have an antivirus, in my case, I have Bitdefender, we're going to add an exception. So go to your antivirus, go to something like your settings, your antivirus settings. In my case, I need to go here and then manage your exceptions. You should go ahead and add a new exception. This is based on your antivirus, so you might, you might need to search it up, sorry. Then go to browse your files and the file that we need to and the file that we need to make an exception about is the Riot Games file. So usually this is located in the Acer C and then here you see Riot Games. So we need to have this file right here. Click on OK, then just enable uh, everything that you would like to enable and then save your exception. Once you have done that, we need to restart Valorant and open it up, open it up again. And this should work. In most cases, it should now be fixed, but I have a third solution that may work for you. And this is to change the DNS server. So what we will need to do is right here, search for control panel. Now, once this opens up, now once this opens up, we need to go to network and internet. Then we go to network and sharing center right here. Click on your connection. So in my case, it's ethernet. Then go to properties. And here you should see your IP4, Internet Protocol IP4. Click on property. Now in these properties, we need to type the following address. So first of all, type 888. Type 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8 and then alternate type 8.8.4.4. Then click on OK, click on close. And now just uh, try to open it again and this should fix your problem. If this fixed your problem, please like and subscribe and I'd say thank you for watching.